Alright. Game development. Pick a topic. Shall we do another fantasy game? I'll have it be another... Oh, let's do a casual game this time. We'll do a... Technology-based game. It's casual. And let's do it for... The Venegear. And we'll pick that engine. Jesus, small, medium. We'll, we'll make it small. Alright, um... And then we'll call this one, uh... Circuit Breaker. And we'll blast this one out. We don't need story and quests. Engine we don't need to focus that much on. We'll throw in game tutorials this time. But we need a we need a game. We need a good game. We're not doing too well now. Intelligence, not so much. Dialogues, not at all. Oh, I didn't see what the other option was. That's fine. Sound is great. World design, we don't need. Open world, okay. We don't need it to be open world. Because it's just like a puzzle game. Casual. Get that bug worked out. Oh, I finished it with a bug. <laughs> no! Let's release a day patch. Day one update. Level design, that's good. Dynamic sound. Nice, Jessica. Nice, Jane. Release the game. Character pro progression. 3D graphics, V1. Yeah, we want 3D graphics. First review, a circuit breaker came in. There's gonna be a bug in it. Uh, I thought the bug was gone. It's gonna stay full of bugs. Fun at stages, it's not bad. Okay, that's not going to give us hardly anything uninspiring. Holy smokes. Meh. Well, at least it's selling decently well. I mean, it's not like breaking the bank. Alright, let's find a publishing deal. Get your games in front of a large audience. Okay, your publisher, you need to sign a contract. The contract will dictate what game you need to create. Pay attention to the details. Most importantly, the minimum score. Contract dictates it's a game you release does not meet that minimum score. You'll have to pay a penalty, which can be costly. It is also important to pay attention to the royalty rate. The higher the rate, the more money you will make from the contract. 11% royalties. Upfront pay is 90k. Technology adventure up front 75. Up front 75. What's the royalties on this one? 8%? 9%? Any topic simulation. 90k. Okay. We'll pick a topic. Farming. Simulation, pick a platform. We'll do it on PC. We'll do it on Game Engine 3. We'll call this Crop Duster 2. Next. Yep, we'll keep that. Creating larger games is a significant task 
and unlike in small games, one person cannot effectively be responsible for every aspect of a game. To create a good game and make the best of your team, you will have to assign which your team is responsible for which areas. Great. Pick team members whose skills match the area to get the best results. When you assign a team member responsible, you will see their workload. Try not to overload them too much. Tech is 31. We don't need simple cutscenes. We don't need a story. So that'll save some money. Save game and game tutorials are important. The engine. Let's blast the engine. We'll throw him there. We'll have Jessica work on... Paul work on this with me, and then Jessica and Jane work on the gameplay. So you always have to have somebody that says, oh my god, we need money! Legal copies of Circuit Breaker, I've managed to identify some of them. We would either sue them to defend our copyright or send them warnings and ask them to stop. stop. Let's warn them. Right away. Yeah, you see, he thought I might have pirated this game. Nope, I bought it on Steam. Bank account is in the red. To two hundred thousand. Great. Maybe we should start developing for handheld systems and just bust out a stupid amount of stuff. Level design. Uh, AI. Paul work on AI, Jane work on dialogues, and Jessica help with level design. Nope. Boom. This game isn't gonna do well. This game is not gonna do well. Clear trend towards simulation games recently. Oh my god, there's so many bugs! Jessica, you're gonna work on that. Paul, you're gonna help me out with that. Nope, Paul can't. Nope. How do I drag him away from it? How do I drag him away from it? There we go. Okay. Whew. Jessica, work on graphics with me. Okay. Oh, this game's not gonna do well. We need to do a music simulation game. So many bugs. Oh my god. While doing a publishing deal was obviously a bad idea, because that did not help us out at all. Sorry, no. Graphics are up to level 4. Nice. Nice. Well, hopefully this increase of experience the following staff have earned a raise. Great. They have, they're getting paid so much more, and we're in the red. Okay, Crop Duster 2. Did not do too well. Nice experience. Oh no. It has its moments. Falls a bit short. Ooh, this guy had a potential 10. Nope, I like it. Well, it's decent. You just released Crop Duster 2 to cover your costs. Alright, we can do that. Followed your progression, recent years, imitation at the Games Games Games, also known as G3. By having your own company booth at G3, 
and gain a lot of fans. The G3 committee. All right. Jessica, you're kind of really letting me down here. Or Jane, rather, I should say. No Crop Duster 2 is still selling really well. Holy smokes, it's sold. Meets the required ratings. We are looking forward to future business. Holy smokes. Nice. Create a new engine. We want that. It's going to cost 220 Okay, we're going to change this game engine to the Crustacean Engine 2. We're actually going to name it. It's going to be a lot, but we're going to we're going to be we're going to be okay, I think. Let everybody focus on digging into it. Oh my god, these guys need vacations. I've been overworking them. I'm a terrible boss. We'll finish the engine and then these two will go on vacation. Send on vacation. Send on vacation. Game convention, ooh! We'll go with the large, mm, we don't want a large booth. Mm, we'll go with the small booth, 80K. Oh, but that's so much money. <sighs> yes. All right, so we're gonna start developing a new game. Large game, immediately under 50,000. That's ridiculous. All right, we'll do a thief-based game be an adventure game. We'll do it on that one he that there and we'll try it on the new Crustacean Engine 2. And we're gonna call this Swiper. Swiper, yes! Swiping. There we go. Perfect. Um, we can't do, th we shouldn't do 3D yet. Let's keep it 2D. There. We're gonna wait for Sony to release the PlayStation. Uh, we'll do a linear story, we'll do simple cutscenes. We'll get rid of, no, we'll keep those in there. We'll bump the story up. Yeah, we'll make it super high. 35. We're gonna go into the red again. We're gonna go into the red again. While well, these guys are on vacation. Better dialogues. Bump up that dialogue. Bump up the AI. Uh, we'll drop down those, but we'll keep the AI high. There we go. Perfect. Oh, we're in the negative again. Game convention. G3. Swiper, yes, swiping. Ooh, because we're in the middle of developing a game. 46. Game conference. We had 46,000 people visiting. Design. Let's go for broke. Just Jessica and I working on a game. We're not gonna make our money back on this. Yeah! Very own console called the Play System. It was completely reworked their earlier Play System prototype after an invento <laughs> that canceled the project. 32-bit processing, wholly owned by Boney. Sony, what I meant to say, wholly owned. Solely owned. Volly owned. Sequels! I haven't been able to make sequels before? Alright, 
we'll release this. Hopefully this will give us some, a little bit of money back. Nice, level four on engine. Too bad we can't get like development kits so that way we can be able to have deals where, oh, I should start doing some contracts. That'll help give me some money. Ooh, Paul leveled up. Due to the increase in experience, of course. Multiplayer and stereo sound. Swiper, yes, swiping. Yeah, oh my god, that's terrible. Oh no. Disappointing, abysmal. Pretty bad. Very bad. Great. I feel like Jessica was a bad idea. Let's find some contract work. This will help us out. 72? Seven weeks? I think we can do this. Nah, let's, let's stick with, let's start off here. Have everybody. Has been released. Financial difficulties. Yeah. 784,000 in a year's time? Last time I did that, we were okay. Well, nice again. Alright. We're not quite there. We need to do more contract work. All right, guys, I'm trusting in you. I'm trusting in you. Oh, baby, that's really close. It's really close, it's gonna cut out to our class. Yes! Got it. Except for we're losing way more money. 150K, we're gonna do it, we're gonna go in the negative. We're gonna go for broke, and it's gonna be the Adventures of Eric. And this is going to be the quest to save Xmas. It's going to be fantasy, do RPG. We need to do 100k to do it, develop it for the PlayStation. Sorry, right, we'll do it for the SNES. And then we're gonna use our Crustacean Engine 2. Go! Oh boy. Let's venture into 3D graphics. Let's do it. I don't think we're gonna do very well. Alright. Um. Jessica will have you focus on certain quests. Jane will have you focus on graphics. Paul will help me out with. I guess not. Oh. All right, yeah, Jessica, you're not gonna do anything because Jessica, you let me down a lot. I'm bankrupt. Financial trouble has gone bankrupt, and it appears Behemoth in the gaming industry has purchased the remains of the company. Tronic Mass Production said, We are very excited to have acquired the rights of all the Crustacean previously released titles. Many fans have expressed their disappointment. This is the end of your journey! Oh. 